Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 31 in chapter 23. Chapter 23 is about electric potential. So in this part, we can see we have electron. We just draw it there. Electron carry one unit negative charge, right? So there, we write it there. And then start from stationary, keyword, stationary, initial stationary, right? The distance is a 42.5 cm, then from a fixed point charge, so we draw the point charge there, and the charge carries a Q, and then we write it there. The distance is this one, ask you how fast will the electron be moving when it is very far away, so keyword, when it is very far away, what does that mean? That means in this case, the potential is zero, right? So the electric energy becomes zero. So we can see at initial, the distance is very close, right? The distance is small. So we can consider there must be electric potentials, electric potential energies, right? And the final, we say we don't consider the electric potential energy. All the energy convert to the kinetic energy. Agree? So energy is conserved. So initial potential energy totally convert to the kinetic energy. Agree? Yes. So in so we can get the initial energy as the potential energy. Use the charge, this electron charge times the potential at this position. So where this potential comes from, comes from this fixed point charge, right? So you can write the fixed point charge V at this location, there, right? At the, re, the V as Q over 4 pi epsilon naught R, times the, the electron charge E, so we can get the initial potential energy there. And the final energy, we see this charge, the point charge is fixed, so it does not move, it is stationary, right? And then we don't consider the potential energy. So the final energy is just the kinetic energy of the electron, one half mv square. So we can say initial energy equals the final energy. So we get a function for velocity v and input all the given quantity. You can get answers there. Thank you.